They're Yo. great. They're great. They're great. Misty, how you doing? How you doing? Yo. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Keep on hold me. No, no problem. Mm? Oh, wait, wait a second. You soon know what I'm doing? I'm doing well, but Kingston had me hostage in traffic. So. Okay. How, how, huh? long till, how, long, how long till you reach him? Um, another uh, probably about half an hour. Half hour. We can't wait. You can't, we can't wait. wait. Of course. Yo, listen, man. This is Tanya Stevens. <laughs> we will we, wait. <laughs> It's no joke. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> this is no joke. Yeah, this is Tanya. Room, like, yeah, yeah, cause me no want you in a no trouble. Me no want a light on you. I drive for run home and them thing them. Me no in a that. You see, cause we need you for your music, so we can't yeah, afford you. Yeah, but me say, know. but me say be there, so me happy there. Yes, man. Yes, man. No, so, no worry yourself, man. Me good, man. All right, all right. Me, me I'm going to flatten everything out there, so. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, all right, let me see if, if, if. But so you want give me a little bit of time, maybe come on back when time I get, I get. Yeah, more yeah, no problem, no what problem. No, man, we, we, we are going to wait. We, the people in the world is waiting. We are waiting. So we are right. I will talk to Mr. Crawford and, and Mr. Mataran until you, until we have time and we just you know wait for you. Yeah, for broke up too. Yeah, you see it. <laughs> so you take your time, man. This is the boss lady. All right, this so is all right. May I come on back home? May I come on back all right. home? All right, all right, all right. Head home. Head home and reach home safe. That we want you do. All right. So you see, it's a real thing. Here we go. Yes, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. Heal the king, heal the king, heal the king. Yes, sir. How you doing, <laughs> sir? How you doing? How you doing? Uh, you know I'm living a good life, my brother. How you doing? Listen, listen, right. listen, right. listen, right. listen. The, the, the goat business is running the thing. The goat yeah, business. Man. Yeah, man. Then, well, uh, no thousand two hundred dollars for your pound, I'm working, man. Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah listen. <laughs> Well, I didn't know how... Listen, let me apologize. I didn't know how serious you were. But the <laughs> gold business is running the thing. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Wills, anything we tell yeah. Jamaican people for doing things for me, I do you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah. If I tell them, if I do bees, I do bees. If I do, do goat, I do goat. You know what I mean? Yeah. Mm -hmm. let, let me tell you something. Me, me see, uh, you know, them that know, say you're, you're teaching math. You're mm -hmm. teaching math and you're, you're, you're educating and... The goat business is a is a is a strong. So, was it difficult to start? Was it difficult to start to get in? Or no, well, to get in not difficult because we, we import two billion dollar worth of mutton. Yeah, so Jamaica import two thousand million dollars worth of mutton. Two thousand, we can make a million dollar fight. You understand? Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. From that's what we import. That equal to one hundred and ten thousand animals. But ja, to import ja. them dead, we say one hundred and ten thousand carcass. You get it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, smart, but you smart. never know about it, and me just learn. You know, you're gonna lose yeah. by learning. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yes, 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 yeah. yes, yes. There's yes, a cost yeah. to learning, so yes, you're just yeah, going yeah. through the whole process of learning. Me lose, I'm again, I'm lose, I'm learn. So, so now yeah. me have 400. So the 13th of April was the, is the, is the second anniversary when we buy the first one. You know? Okay, okay, okay. So yeah, wait, yeah. so can people can. Are you allowing people to invest? To, 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 no, to not purchase? really, because, you know I mean, when you have an investor, you can't take all the risks where you want to take because you have other people's money at stake, you know what I mean? Yeah. So until you get the thing perfect, you don't want other people to, to lose with you. You want to get the thing perfect first, and then they say, all right, I understand it totally now. So yes. I can guarantee you your money. Because where's my politician? You know, I'm going to go one back in money. You get me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. and money is a very dangerous no, company. No, dangerous. <laughs> but my intention eventually is to be able to have people to say, yo, me, I give, me want a goat for my daughter. I want a goat for my son, you know? And then okay. I raise okay. it for them yeah. and give them yes. the profit. You know what I mean? Okay. So okay. Yeah, that okay. is my intention. Because a lot of kids can't get them books at the end of the year and stuff like that. Yeah. But but if them okay. have one boat, they might not be able to to protect it and secure it. So yeah, that is my eventual thing. 
Okay, mm-hmm. okay. Listen, listen. As as busy as you are, and and in the situations that you are, you are in, you know, for Jamaica and for yourself, and it it's just an absolute honor for you to be able to 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 be on the platform, even to accept my calls. I really appreciate that because no man, I love. You know? I'm not that busy, you know, but yeah, for going oh. like a business, so people think it's important, okay. you know what I mean? Okay, yeah. okay, 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 <laughs> all right. We have to pull the Damian movement then. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Yeah, that's how well, it looks to me. As it, well, before we even got to the situation, I have to give the people some advice. You see, when the world slow down, you have to yeah. do everything to catch it up. And that's why I put in the grind now, because the world has slowed down. Everybody were used to their head that we be expanding birth right and everything. They yeah. have gotten a, a slowing by the world stopping. So the, it, this is the time when me have to catch them up. And that is why okay. I put in the effort, put in the grind, and put in the time. So that when the world open back, I'm closer to where Butch Stewart was than before. You, okay. you, you understand? So Butch Stewart okay. hotels are now empty. So me can come closer to him if me catch up enough. You get it? Okay. And okay. so people have to take this opportunity now that the world has slowed down to catch up with those who were way ahead of them. If them put yeah. in the effort, you know? So when it yeah. opened up. Your, your shop supposed to ready. Your, your, your hair salon, your barber shop, your, 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 your retail store, whatever you did plan for the long time, supposed to be ready when the world wow. will open. You get it? Yeah. Yeah. But, but how, how do it's so difficult, Mr. Crawford, for the people them to like? Let's say somebody wants a, a, a salon. Like I'm over. I'm talking over here in Canada. You're gonna tell me about. Jamaica. In Canada, mm-hmm. the, the small entities, the small shops, they're all closing down. And I yeah. mean, the, the, and if they're not closing down, they're feeling the brunt of it. Right now, we're in lockdown, total lockdown. You go out dollar store, certain mm-hmm. section you can't buy nothing out at the dollar store. You have to only buy the food part only. That's what they've done. Right? Yeah, they have, well, what happened now, you know, you see that, what this is, this is an opportunity. If, if 10 men used to sell back juice and 10 men used to buy back juice, the fact that five men drop out of the business is now an opportunity to the five different men. Mm. Or an opportunity to the five that remain to get to sell two back juice instead of one back juice. Right. You understand? So yeah. some people look at me now and say, I'm a madman because I'm expanding my business. I'm building more um, houses. I'm putting in more eggs egg, because I do eggs as well. I'm putting in more coke. Because when the hotel opened back, is who ready? Who don't ready get left behind? Mm-hmm. You understand? So this is the time, even though it's difficult. If if it was easy, everybody would do it, and then there will be no value. Yeah, understand. Value, yeah. So so is the difficulty that cause or who willing to take on that risk? Who willing to take on that chance? And so the people, Jamaica's an anti-failure country, you know? and that's one of the biggest negatives to our business because we're ashamed to fail. Wiz, okay. feel enough time, you know. Yes, sir. You know, yes, I remember yes, one time I started a t-shirt brand called Crazy Wear. And I walk and I sell t-shirt in a scandal bag. Mm-hmm. You understand? And yes, sir. And by the time it comes a boom, I lose. One time I keep a party called Doubles 2 to 2. When the government said 2 o'clock, lock off. I said, all right, I keep a party from 2 p.m. to 2 a.m. And rain fall and I lose $2 That's a 2004. I don't pay the loan in 2011. Mm-hmm. You understand? So I yeah. lose. We start another thing called book trade. We rent book a UA and the bookshop comes and find a class. We said them are the only people that are supposed to distribute book as versus sell book. And the universe yeah. right now, I have to lock down. We lose. So and then one or two times, I try a thing and lose. Yeah. We start yeah. yard travel in my, in my bedroom, in my living room, selling Jamaicans cheap rooms. And lose. Yeah. Now I say, go stop on them people. Eh, I make millions. Sometimes you really have to drink coconut water to make sure your heart not dirty and your mind not bad. But at the same time, enough time to try things and enough time to lose. But if you know, have that conscience at heart to try and that, that lack of shame, you, you, you understand? So yeah. what happened now with a whole heap of Jamaican, them shame to fail. And that shame prevent them from trying. You, 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 you get me? Because we're anti- 
fail a society. You, you understand? But that is how them, them train we, you know, because what has happened, you see, the people with privilege, they tell you the opposite of what they do. Mm. The people Say with that privilege, one more time. Say that again. Say that one more time. With privilege, tell you the opposite of what they do. So the man will inherit from Fim Father. We are look upon some of these Chinese. We are look upon some of these um Indians. We are look upon some of these these Asians, some of these white people. For them father come down poor and broke and take a risk. Mm -hmm. And having taken that risk, can now give them things to make them be the top of the society. And then they now frown upon we if we take our risk now. Wow. You, you, you wow. get me? So of course, yeah, of course I'm, mm -hmm. I'm, I'm overstanding. I, I'm, 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 I'm listening to you and I'm understanding. I'm like, wow, isn't that something? But that means that uh, what happens to the people that ask for the help? They ask for the help. That means that uh, prob probably somebody's looking at them and saying, "Boy, if this person's asking, I don't want to see them reach where I'm reaching." Yeah. So they're gonna tell me. So they're gonna tell them something. Tell you something. Yeah, they're gonna tell you something different. That's why I'm going to say, when you check me, anything I tell them, me and do. Anything me say to them, say, yo. I'm going to say, yo, focus on education. That's because that's how we make it. Our education make me make it. You understand? I'm born in a lane. Yeah. I have dirt road. I have zinc fence. I have running water. But I have to go down by, um, by standpipe. And education make me make it. If scamming they make me make it, me that tell them that. But I don't know about that. If jobs they make me make it, me that tell them that. I don't know about that. What I know is that I put my shoulder to the wheel. Me learn some things. And that knowledge has been paid for. People pay me for that knowledge. You get me? So the other day, yeah. I go up on a talking tour. I can't believe it up to now. I go up on a talking tour. I go talk to the Caribbean. I make $2 million. So I said to people, say, yo, I know we can talk. You understand? But yeah. all we don't think. So it's because of how we think. Make me make a money if I'm talking. You free? So, yeah, yeah. me I tell them when me do, when me go through, when me learn. So, me in the farming now, I tell them, say, yo, me make 10 grand off of each goat. Therefore, you go in at the goat thing. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah the, that man do, yeah. The, the goat thing mm -hmm. is, is, is the end thing. All if you don't eat meat or mutton, just. Then, get the that's goat the profit. The profit, sure, man. If you don't eat meat, the profit, you're not going to eat out the profit. <laughs> you're not going to eat the goat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if you don't eat meat, the profit, secure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well. that, that, that is true. That is true, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. Let me not. just be a little pig pen. I'm gonna eat pig, man. That you said I come at the wall of the profit. But, but, I, I just went there, man. I just went yeah. there. I just went there, man. Yeah, the food, yeah. Why, yo, mm -hmm. Jano, it's a blessing to to see a man of your stature just be able to, you know, so remain so so humble and so down to earth and so within the community man because when we look from the outside it's very difficult because when you hear the word politician you think of you know heavy artillery cars blockage and and, and don't talk to people who yeah. are in the community but it's very very rare and i and i don't take this opportunity for granted at all and i don't think the people on the live and around the world should take this opportunity for granted because these things that are, are uh we're talking to a gentleman who's in of you know a very um how, how could i say i i saw i saw a a a meme that you were in and it was in the office of course and you know you were making your speech and saying what you had to say but they wanted you to quiet up real quick and real fast <laughs> and, yeah. you know yeah. and i'm like no mr crawford i'm my <laughs> bridging that no no they're <laughs> easy going easy I'm, I'm not into the politics but them them rush, everybody if you have them yeah, them, yeah. Them, them, them them say and them talk you know what, i want that what them a, one of my friends them say me at jamaica yame you know because no matter how them quarry <laughs> no matter how them cost me by next week we love them again you know what i mean but yeah, 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 yeah. We used to get an opportunity in our life because of what people fought for. People before me, they fight for black yeah. people like me and poor people like me to get opportunities to go Casey. The yeah. question I may have to answer is what may I go fight for for somebody else. And that is why I mean to this. Other people go in a Rotary, other people go in a Kiwanis, other people do selecting, other people do shows, other people go in a media. I feel yeah. some my way to help my country is through politics. You get me? So yeah. most times politicians are frowned upon and even not for the artists them, them bond politicians. Even when me talk to them, they must say, I don't need them to talk. But 
um, that is a way where me think me can help because with that influence, me can change policy, me can change law. If me should be the prime minister, when me believe becomes the, 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 the law. While if me not, when me believe is just a statement. Let me, let me ask you this. With all that you know right now and all that's going on, let's just say in a, in a world of, of uh, Mr. Crawford, you were in Mr. Um, Andrew Holness' shoes right now. You were mm -hmm. this man. Would you be making the same decisions and making the same movements that he is making now? No. But at the same time, hindsight is 2020. Heavy is the head where we are the crown. Anybody when I unite can say anything they want. Right? Yes. Because you don't yes. even have the same influences and the same forces coming at you. So so may I have to put that caveat to say, yo, okay, I don't know all the forces coming at you. Because politics is one of the hardest things to decide into. Because every time you do something for one person, it affects somebody else. I was guild president at UA. Everybody agreed for school fee lower. So when we lock the gate for school fee reduce, everybody agree. The principal now agree, but he's not a part of my constituents. The prime minister don't have that reality. Everybody's a part of his constituents. But I disagree with what he's doing on a mathematical level, on a logical level. You understand? Because yes. there, most of the Jamaican populace depend on people interaction for earning. So if people now interact, them can't earn. Like the vendor depend upon people interaction. The hairdresser depend upon people interaction. The, the, the party person, whether it is the promoter or the sound man or whatever, depend upon people interaction. You get what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So when yes. people now interact, these people are suffering. Therefore, a government must contribute to mitigate against that suffering if it is going to reduce interaction of people. The government felt it necessary to reduce interaction, like even this lockdown, for example. But they have not yes. subsidized the, 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 the hairdresser, who, when a hairdresser loses a weekend, she loses a week. Yes. You yes. get me? Yes. So if yes. she loses yes. three weekends, she loses a month. So if you now mm -hmm. pay her rent, you leave her to be kicked out. You leave her to suffer. So mm -hmm. I think that mathematically, it is illogical in how they are going about it. But at the same time, me no know all the variables that is coming to him. You get me? But me disagree with his strategy of the lockdown, of the curfews, and of the methodology that he's using. And, and I mean, the, the, the outcomes is showing, say, now nah, work. The outcomes is showing, say, it's still an increase. So if you intervene, if you are throw a particular thing into your drinks, and you find, say, nah, sweet, then you must accept, say, it's not sugar. It's not sugar. Okay. It's not sugar. And, and, and that is what he, he hasn't accepted because it's not working. So, so yeah, I'd have done um, differently um, with all that I know. But if, if, I, if I was in his shoes, I would have known more and then made I know what is his circumstance. Okay. Now, I'm from the outside looking in, from the way outside, halfway of this side of the world looking in. But it's an it's a island that where my grandmother raised me in St. Anne's. It's an island where both of my parents are born and from. It's an island that gave me a music, a culture that I embrace and that I love. And I, you know, I, I, I honestly, sorry, I'm just waiting for Mataran and Tanya Stevens. Yeah, man, yeah, man. Um, you know, this culture, I don't know the depths, like some selectors, I don't know, you know, in the streets of Jamaica, like some selectors, of course, I'm on the outside. So I, I, I humbly, you know, listen and I learn a lot from talking to Trooper Mataran, our links, our, our, you know, other selectors from here in Canada who used to come from Jamaica. So be it. What? Um, but this is your territory. The, the entertainment and the tourism is right part of your yeah. territory, what oh. you're supposed to control. And it's been hit the hardest and the people in the island who I talk to, whether it's my cousin, whether it's family, whether it's friend, are feeling it the most. And I'm talking, it's trickling effect. Why I, I fight for this culture is going to, if it fades in Jamaica, I believe the rippling effect is that it fades around the world because that is the hub center of our 
culture of our music. Yeah. You, you agree or you disagree? Yeah, no, totally agree. But even more importantly, um, people earn a living through one or two ways. They earn a living through wages or through profit. As machines replace human beings, they have less of an ability to earn a wage. So we used to have like um, um, free zone and stuff like that where factories used to be in Jamaica and the people who were less informed, less educated, um, used to earn a wage through those entities. Now that them can't earn a wage, they're seeking to earn a profit. And so because they never born rich or they don't have a lot of investments, they are going into what I call industries for the poor, like vending is an industry for the poor. Man buy something and sell it back. Taxi is an industry for the poor. And entertainment has always been an industry for the poor because it has low barriers to entry, right? A, a, a hotel is not an industry for the poor because the, the investment necessary, you won't be able to find it. But a man keeping a round robin, for example, he might only need 40 grand because he paid the selector after they, they, he make the money, he, he, he get a lick right. upon consignment, etc., etc. So if you take away the possibility to earn through wage because of automation and mechanization, and you take away the possibility to earn through profits because you know um, you, you basically um, um, operate against those industries. If you look at how government treat vending, if you look at how government treat taxi, if you look at how government treat, treat um, entertainment, those in, they're legislated against. But industries for the rich are legislated for. So you find that so the hotel is making a lot of money this, 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 this holiday period. And this is not a, a chant against the hotel. No. This is just an identification of an inequity. Because the industry for the rich has been allowed to, to prosper, and the industry for the poor has been allowed to die. So nothing's not making any sense to me then, because mm -hmm. it, are, are you telling me COVID stops at the hotel? Is, is, that what, that's, well, is that what's looking? Is that what's going on here? Uh, because... <laughs> If you look at the logic, you know? yeah? if you look at the logic, you're saying that you want separation because the virus needs people to survive. So you have to give me. If you don't give me, it die with you or you kill it. So therefore, you have to give me. You want a reduction in interaction. Most events, parties are community based. Therefore, it is only the people within that community that really attend that event. Most events. Uh, then they advertise on radio. You understand? So okay. therefore, that is of less risk than the hotel because the hotels have multiple communities and multiple countries. So the risk at a hotel is higher. Now, again, you know, make you know, so a fight a hotel. Let us show that there is yes. an inequity in how we are approaching this thing and an illogical inequity because you have logical inequity now. You have reasons to be biased against a particular group for a particular reason. That becomes a logical inequity. But then you have illogical inequity, which is what we call prejudice. You get me? So therefore, okay. when this, this inequity is illogical, it is bias. It is prejudice. And, and there is a, a high prejudice against the entertainment Partially because them think it a cause crime. Partially because them think it is recreation more than business. And also because the poor are the major participants within the industry. Both the consumption and the production. So therefore, they don't have the influence on government as the wealthy do. Understood. Mr. Crawford, and, and listen, I, I keep asking you because you are, you are a man who I totally respect and you're full of intelligence and you understand, in what's, you understand what I'm saying and you understand what's going on in the streets as well as in the parliament, in, in, the, mm -hmm. in, in the government. But here's my thing. Violence is what is being bestowed upon by, I, I would say, uh, vocally, what the prime minister has said has is causing a thing. How many dances and selectors or patrons inside the dance has there been a violent outburst? Like, and we oh. hear violence is on the island, but I don't hear in the dance. No, I'm no, talking no, no. In the dance. Um, Maybe I don't know. So, what if you could, you know, teach me. Prime minister said is is untruthful and basically is rubbish. Um, there's been many research by many countries. Norway has done research on the impact of, of um, entertainment to, to, to actual violence. Um, the United States have done research. 
um, Finland has done research, but also multiple researchers. I wrote an article coming out in the Friday um, Star, you'll see tomorrow, that is stating okay. all the articles that have suggested um, that matter about peer reviewed researchers, doctors mm -hmm. in philosophy, doctors in psychology, that says entertainment does not um, create um, violent intent. You, you, you understand. Now, make a look yes. on the simple mathematics, right? There's a okay. relationship we call causal relationship, right? So that means that X cause Y, like how sugar makes things sweet. There's a way to prove a causal relationship. Two things must exist. One, it must be majority outcome. And two, it must be shared direction. So it means that the majority of times that this thing is, is, is interfaced, the majority of times you put sugar into water, it gets sweet. And the more sugar you put in, is the sweeter it will get. Now, if you look on it, if we give every murder to a different murderer, we have no more than 1,600 murderers. If a man kill one man and stop, we have 1,600 murderers. One million of us have consumed this violent music. So the vast majority of who consume violent music don't become violent. So that disproves causality. You, you, you understand what I'm saying? No, yeah, if a I'm man following. who is less informed, who's less educated to do, who had criminal intent, consume the music, the music never caused him. He already had criminal intent. You, 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 you understand Correct. what I'm saying? So therefore, that yes. is one. The second thing is, the, the, the music, in particular this example that the Prime Minister was speaking to, it was the murder of a female. The music is anti-murder of females. Yeah. Right. The, the, the dance hall speak again. And I mean, since the girl there, popcorn, all of them come out saying, don't kill women. Now, listen exactly. to me. If bounty killer can say anytime I'm hungry again, you have to see me nine. And you take up a nine. Why when him say book, 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 you never take up a book? Take up a book. That's so, 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 so if, 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 I, I don't know. <laughs> I'm a little lost. <laughs> so, I'm a little lost. Yeah. Because uh, the, the, the reason I'm a little lost. <laughs> yo, uh, yeah, yeah, well, uh, yo you, you need a bounty sample right yeah. now. Right? <laughs> Right, I you know what uh, go on then. Uh, it is, it is, I'm, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a little lost, right? I'm a little lost, so. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Oh my God! Yo, calm down. I'm not the smartest person in the world, but I'm. The, uh, this is my thought process. The island that is one of the most requested, traveled. And an island that the, the 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 nation, the people of the island, there is a Jamaican every single where in this world. So it it, it is so dominant. It is so you know well rounded. I I, I would say. I'm looking at a, a prime minister, and this is no disrespect because I don't know him. So I, and I and I don't deal with those things. I'm not I'm not being disrespectful to him. I'm just stating the fact that. How do you look at the people that are on your island that you are supposed to govern and you know that this music is is the national it's 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 just the culture it is the yeah. culture why would you stop it seeing as how there's no change if you do this lockdown and you stop these these people and you and you feel like okay, this is what it is. Like I mean, I'm all for him protecting the people against COVID. I'm all for that. And he does have a difficult job to do. I understand that as well. But why tell us then, though, that this is causing violence? That this is the when and he played dub plays, didn't he? Have dub plays <laughs> playing for well, he had was, one of the most violent songs. I say, yo, um, government badness. But again. As you said, the Prime Minister's job is a difficult job. It I personally good. thank him for taking on this task. You understand? Because it is something that he volunteered to do, right? Knowing the difficulties that exist. In the same way, me a volunteer and other people volunteer. But I am grateful for his efforts. You know, me, me agree with his outcomes. Me, but, but me know, say, I don't think he has negative intent. I don't think nobody come and start to say, you know what, I want to mash up the country. But I'm looking at and I'm saying, yo, I agree with this, I agree with that. No, Jamaica is known for a little game 
that has trained us to blame somebody else. It's called who stole the cookie from the cookie jar. You say, who me? Yes, you. Couldn't be. Okay. Then you do. Number nine stole the cookie. So when the pressure gets to the prime minister, the prime minister...